Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, depending on when this video finds you. Let's go ahead and come into a seated position, straighten out the spine. Point your finger and thumbs come to touch. Palms face up to receive an increase of energy, or palms face down to receive a grounding energy from the Mother Earth below you. Start to close your eyes. Relax your shoulders, relax your jaw, and relax your eyebrows. Start to just breathe and just watch your breath naturally. Let's take a deep breath in through the belly, but we're gonna breathe through the nose. So the breath is gonna be about two thirds here in the belly. And then the last part is gonna be sent through the heart chakra, through the throat, throat, uh, throat chakra. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, relax the shoulders, release. Again, take a deep breath in. Relax the shoulders, exhale, release. Now we're gonna start to kind of calm down the exhale a little bit. So we're gonna again breathe in. And then we're gonna exhale, keep your mouth closed, exhale through the nose, create the sound of the ocean in the back of the throat, yoga, ocean breath, ujjayi. Almost as if you were going to fog a mirror right in front of you. The sound will happen naturally. Again, take a deep breath in. Exhale, ujjayi. Relax the shoulders. Again, one more ujjayi, breathing in. Exhale, ujjayi. Sit up a little bit taller, hold the chest up high. Hold the chin up a little bit as well. Again, we're gonna breathe in, this time for a round of Om Shanti, sound of the universe and then peace. Breathing in. shoulders again relax the jaw start to just relax anything that you feel a little bit um, is holding a little bit of tension again we're gonna breathe in for Om Shanti breathing in Set your intention for what you would like to receive after today's class. We have four more breaths here. One more round of Om Shanti. Breathing in. Hold it at the top just for a moment. Relax the shoulders. Ask your heart what it would like to receive out of today's little flow. Exhale. Om Shanti. telling your body um, the energy that you would like to receive out of today's class so it's important to set that intention so we have three more breaths in except this time we're gonna go ahead and bring we're gonna keep the left hand exactly where it is bring the right arm up 
and we're gonna just bring the two piece fingers right here down. So we only have three fingers up now. We're gonna go ahead and gently place just enough so it closes the left nostril here. Your ring finger on your right hand closes your left nostril. Make sure we're not pressuring. This is yoga, so it's nice and gentle. And we're gonna go ahead and breathe in. Take a deep breath in. So that's going through the left or the right nostril. We're gonna go ahead and gently start to bring the right thumb to close and tap onto the right nostril. We're gonna exhale, release through the left nostril. Should hear the ocean breath. We're gonna reset the left nostril now. So we're just gonna lightly tap it. Just to reset it, we're going to breathe in through the left nostril. Going to slowly start to close the left nostril, open up the right nostril, exhale, release through the right nostril. Gently tap the right nostril, breathing in through the right nostril. Close the right nostril, open up the left nostril, exhale through the left nostril. Gently tap the left nostril to reset it. Breathe in through the breathe into the left nostril and inhale. Gently close the left nostril, open up the right nostril, exhale through the right nostril. So we're going to do one more on each side. Gently start to tap the right nostril to reset. Breathe in through the right nostril. Close the right nostril, exhale through the left nostril. One more time on the left side. Tap the, le uh, the left nostril. Tap the left nostril. Oh, and breathe in through the left nostril. Close the left nostril. Ex and open up the right nostril. We're gonna exhale through the right nostril. Gently place the right hand back down onto the knee. And we're just gonna take three deep breaths through the nose, through both nostrils to reset the nostrils breathing. Breathe in. Exhale, ocean breath. Breathe in. Exhale. Breathe in. Exhale. Relax the shoulders. Relax the eyebrows and the jaw. Inhale, raise the arms all the way up. Exhale, bring your hands to heart center. Bow your head down. Namaste. Perfect. Way to go. We're gonna inhale, raise the arms all the way up. We're gonna come into a spinal twist. Exhale, twist over to the right side of your body. Right hand reaches behind you. And left hand, see if it can reach for your, your knee or wherever you feel like going today. Um, and we're just gonna twist. See if you can look all the way behind you for a little bit of an extra twist. Keep that spine straight. Gently back to center, inhale, raise the arms up above your head, twist uh, to the other side. <laughs> left side this time, reach that left hand to reach behind you. Right hand reaches for that knee or wherever it can reach. Keep that spine straight and twist. Gently 
gently back to center. Great job. We're going to inhale, raise the arms up. Exhale, hands to heart center. Gently with your belly button going down first. We're just going to slowly place the hands down onto the mat. And then just release the head here. Take a moment of gratitude for your heart center. Start to finish up with your intention right now if you haven't done that yet. Bow your head down a little bit more. Allow your head to kind of just go from left to right. Massage out the neck here. And then gently start to come back up. Great job. Let's go ahead and come into a tabletop position right now. Knees are going to be underneath your hips. Wrists are going to be underneath your shoulders. Let's come into a cat-cow massage out the spine. Inhale, belly button to the mat. Heart lifts up. Exhale, arch the spine and chin to chest. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, arch the spine, chin to chest. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, arch the spine, chin to chest. Pull the shoulders up, pull them, pull them, pull them. Inhale, slowly start to come back up. Belly button to the mat, heart lifts up, chin lifts up. Exhale, bottom of your toes. Come to the mat, lift up your hips, downward dog. Look all the way to your belly button. Walk out your dog. Take a deep breath in. Deep breath out. Let's go ahead and bring your left foot to center. We're going to inhale, lift up the right leg. This is our first three-legged dog, so we might be a little um, not too open yet. We're, so we're just gently going to open it a little bit here. Place your right foot back down. Switch. Right foot comes to center. We're going to inhale, lift up the left leg here. A little bit here, three-legged dog. And rest and relax. Back into your downward dog, open up the shoulders. Look to the belly button. Looking forward to the front of your mat now. We're gonna go ahead, step, walk, or jump to the front of the mat. Inhale, halfway up, straight spine. Exhale, forward bend. Inhale, raise the arms up. So we're gonna come into a chair now. Raise the arms up as if there is an imaginary chair to reach behind you. Exhale, forward bend, ragdoll, hold on to each elbow, and go from left to right. Allow your lower back and hips to kind of open here. Allow your shoulders to get heavy, allow your head to get heavy, and just dangle in the wind. Gently start to place your hands down or wherever they can reach, but we're gonna go ahead and walk our feet over to the outer edges of the mat. So our toes are at the outer edges of the mat now. We're gonna go ahead and inhale, raise those arms up, come into your chair pose, except this time our knees are gonna be out. Exhale, bring your hands to heart center. Option to remain here or option to come a little bit lower, elbows in. Open up the hips, keep the spine straight, lift up the chin. Gently start to place your hands down. Let's go ahead, step back. We're going to take a deep breath in. Come into a plank pose, shoulders above the wrist. Option to bring your knees down for the chaturanga. Exhale, chaturanga, elbows in. Option to come down to your belly. We're going to inhale, use the toes, push you forward, lift up the chest, upward dog, and then we're going to exhale back into your downward dog. Walk out your dog here, lift up one heel and then the other. Deep breath in, deep breath out. Let's go ahead and turn the left heel into a 45 degree angle. We're going to step forward with the right foot out in front. Inhale, raise the arms up, come into warrior one on the left, uh, on the right side. 
Bring the left hip forward, hips parallel to the front of the mat. Maybe your gaze looks up to your fingers. Exhale, hands to heart center. Frame the right foot. Fix that left foot here, adjust it. And then we're gonna inhale, come back into the plank. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, lift up, upward dog. Exhale, downward dog. Great job. Take a deep breath in. Exhale. Let's go ahead and turn the right heel in to a 45 degree angle. Step forward with your left foot out in front. We're going to inhale, raise the arms up. Bring the right hip forward. Exhale, hands to heart center. Place your hands down. Inhale, come into your plank. Last, chaturanga. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, lift up the heart. Exhale, downward dog. We're going to step forward to the front of the mat, coming into a standing position at the front. And then we're going to go ahead and step to the side of your mat. So this would be my left leg coming out. We're going to make sure that our feet are, our heels are in one line with one another. Toes are going to be pigeon toe. So they're going to be slightly kind of inward, just a little bit. We're going to flex the quadriceps, hamstrings, flex the legs just so that they're engaged. We're going to inhale, raise the arms up. Exhale, let's go ahead, keep those heels right in line with one another how they are. We're going to turn the left toes in just a little bit so they're at like a 45 degree angle. Still keep those legs engaged. And the right foot is going to point to the front of the mat. And inhale. Hands are going to come parallel to the mat. Keep those legs engaged. Exhale, lean forward as if somebody were grabbing onto those right fingertips. Once you can't reach anymore, we're going to go ahead and place the right hand down onto the yoga mat. If you have a yoga block, this is a great time to use one. And bring that left arm up. Maybe continue your deep breathing. Breathe in. Gaze looks over up to your fingertips if you would like to. Exhale, gently start to bring that left hand down. Bend the right knee. Adjust that back foot. We're sort of going to bring that back a little bit here. Our right arm and right leg on the shin are going to be in line with one another. And then we're going to inhale and raise the left arm up to the sky. Coming into half triangle pose. Exhale, bring your hand down, left hand down. Adjust that back foot. Place that, uh, that left knee back onto the mat. Bring the right uh, hand to the outer edge of your right foot. And we're gonna push that hip forward. Inhale, lift up the chest, open up the hip flexor. Exhale, and then back. Great job. Let's come back into the downward dog. Just a good deep breath in here. Deep exhale out, take a break. Then we're going to go ahead and do the other side this time. So we're going to step forward to the front of the mat, facing the other side. So we're going to do the other side this time. This time our left foot points to the back of the mat. And then our right toes follow to a 45 degree angle. Keep your heels in line with one another. Keep your legs engaged. Inhale, raise the arms up. Exhale, hand, arms parallel to the mat. The, yep, just like that on top of the mat. Inhale, and then we're going to exhale, follow the left fingertips as if somebody were pulling onto those fingertips. And when you can't pull anymore, coming into a triangle pose on the left side here, raise the right arm up. Breathing in, look up to the right fingertips. Option to use that yoga block if you have one. 
Exhale, bring the right hand down, great job. This time we're gonna bring that uh, left leg so that it's gonna come into a bend, 90 degree angle. And then we're gonna gently start to keep that left hand where it is on the inside of your left foot. Keep the arm and the shin on the left side in line with each other. We're gonna gently start to inhale, raise the right arm up to the sky. Maybe your gaze follows to the fingertips. Exhale, gently start to release, nice job. Let's walk back to center. Keep your legs at a three, three and a half feet wide from one another. We're gonna gently start to come up vertebrae by vertebrae. The, uh, toes are pigeon toed towards each other, so they're pointing towards each other just a little bit. Engage the legs, um, so make sure they're nice and strong. We're gonna inhale, raise the arms up. Exhale, bring your hands to your hips. Lean forward with your belly button first. Keep those legs engaged. And then gently start to release, come into a forward bend. Take about three deep breaths here. Allow your head to get heavy. Maybe if you would like, maybe your two-piece fingers wrap around your big toes for support. Maybe coming down a little bit lower here. Gently start to come back out of that. And then we're gonna place our knees down onto the mat and then bring your seat down onto the mat, coming into facing the front of the mat, seating position. Hands to the side, keep your knees bent. I'm gonna massage out those hips here. Just roll from one side to the other, windshield wiper. Okay, let's go ahead, bring those legs out in front of you. Keep the legs engaged. Keep the, uh, bring the toes so that they point to the ceiling above you. Straighten out the spine. We're gonna take a deep breath in, raise the arms up to the sky. Exhale, lean forward with your belly button. Fall forward, hands come to your quadriceps, shins, ankles, wrap around your big toes or come all the way to reach for the bottom of your feet. Relax your head down. Taking another deep breath in, deep breath out. Gently vertebrae by vertebrae, starting to come back out of that. We're gonna go ahead and bring the bottoms of the feet to come to touch. Wrap your hands around your uh, feet. Open up the hips here, straighten out the spine, lift up the chin, breath in. Exhale, lean forward with your belly button. Go as far as you can and gently start to release. Come into relaxing pose here, butterfly pose. Gently, slowly start to come back out of that. Let's go ahead and come down onto our mat now. Let's take a full body stretch. Legs are gonna extend to the bottom of the mat. Arms reach above your head, deep breath in. Full body stretch. Exhale, bring your arms to the side, coming into a T position. Um, so they're right in line with the shoulders down. We're gonna have to bend the knees here. Uh, yeah, bend the knees here. Keep your feet so they're hip distance apart. 
Deep breath in, and then we're gonna exhale, keep, bring the knees to fall to the left side of the mat. And maybe our gaze comes over to look to your right fingertips here. Gently start to come back up, straight spine. Inhale, and then we're gonna exhale, opposite side. Maybe your gaze looks over to the left side. Gently come back to center. Let's make any last movements that you would like to make, and then coming into Shavasana, laying down pose. Feet at the outer edges of your mat, hands at the outer edges of your mat. Take a deep breath in. Hold everything tight, clench your body and every little muscle, exhale and release and let everything go. Shoulders, jaw, eyes, eyebrows, legs, arms, hands and feet. Option remain here and meditate for as long as you would like. Once you're ready, roll over to the right side of your body, give yourself a hug. Wrap your arms around your knees, tuck your knees into your chest, take a deep breath in, exhale, release. Take a moment of gratitude for anything you would like to take a moment of gratitude for. With your eyes still closed, gently come up into a seated position. Keep that spine straight and tall. Deep exhale out, release. Breathe in, raise the arms all the way up. Exhale, hands to heart center. Bow your head down. Namaste. Have a great rest of your day. Take care of yourself. Remember to drink water, please. Eat really healthy foods to replenish your body. And um, remember to be very intentional with your thoughts and what we're creating inside of our body and without. Um, have a great rest of your day. Can't wait to see you again tomorrow.